Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to Temporary. So, we've got a lot of things to uh, go over. <laughs> um, so, as you can see, uh, I haven't pushed up since last time. This is the beginning of the episode, so welcome back. Woohoo, let's go. Um, so, yeah. We have gotten a few new cards, like Heal Spirit, Bowler, Rascals, and we also got Graveyard. But Graveyard is unlocked in Spooky Town, so... Okay, so let's see. So first of all... What do we gotta get rid of? I can't get rid of this, this, this... Or no, this, 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 this. So, automatically, let's just get rid of Mega Knight. Then we'll go Bowler... And then we'll go Rascals. So I believe this is everything up to date. We got that, we got that. And then just six cards from here, I think. Or no, oh yeah, yeah, I can use Graveyard. But I just replaced Graveyard. <laughs> so. I think, I think this is good. Are all three of them from that arena? Yeah, okay, we're good. Alright, so this is our new deck, um... <laughs> it's a bit under leveled right now, but we'll be able to fix that in a bit. Also, we can upgrade Firecracker, so let's go. So we have a ton of Rascal upgrades. <laughs> I think they'll get to like level 8, maybe? Definitely 7, if not 8. Okay, it won't be 8, but it'll be 7. So Rascals are at a decent level. We need their Heal Spirit up, though. Let's get our Heal Spirit probably up to 5 or 6. Um... Excuse me, because we do not want weak cards, that is for sure. Not that it really serves, you know, a purpose as, like, a tank or a damage dealer, but just good to have your cards upgraded anyway. And let's also go ahead and upgrade our bowler. I think we're fine to keep our bowler at level 8, honestly. Unless I see a reason to get it to level 9. And yeah, I mean, this is the deck. I, th I think we're fine with this, maybe? I still got two crown chests. I probably won't pop those open. I'll open these silver chests, though. Firecracker's rare. Oh, we'll take it. We can also upgrade a few cards down here, too, like Big Bone Jones. Let's get him to level 9. Let's get the Ice Gloom up to level 9. Let's get the Goblins up to level 8. Let's go. Snowball up to level 8. Yeah, I've, I've neglected a few uh, upgrades, you could say. Then let's upgrade Dark Prince. Is there anything else? Uh, I don't think so. Um, alright, I think that's everything, so, uh, yeah, let's just head into the first match. Alright, up against Andres here, so I guess let's go ahead and split our wall breakers for first play. Okay, never mind, I didn't know what sound I was at. Okay, just goes for the hog, I could've went bowler, but let's go rascals instead, I think, I was gonna say it should only be one hit, but I think that's Zap on another, so... Unfortunate, but it is what it is. Okay, maybe it's a good thing I didn't use the bowler here, but I can also use firecracker, so... We'll see. I think I'll just go Firecracker in the back for now. If he does anything else, then I might have to bowler. Yeah, I'll bowler because he just put his knight down. I don't really want to deal with that. Beautiful alignment on the big bowler. Thankfully, his balls are big enough, so it hits both the knight and the witch. And the Firecracker's taking 30 years to fire a shot. Let's go bowler, the actual goat. Let's spam a ghost on the opposite lane, see what he wants to do. Won't activate King Tower. Does go for a P.E.K.K.A., so we'll go for an E-Drag here. Yeah, dealing with a P.E.K.K.A. is going to be kind of tough. Uh, I'm going to go Rascals. I don't even know if my Heal Spirit one-shot the Larrys, which is kind of an issue, but it is what it is. If I really need to, I can upgrade my uh, Heal Spirit later. Rascal Girl's putting in the work. Big money there. Let's go for our Wall Breakers and a low Heal Spirit to tank the Wizard shot. Does that, but Rascal Girl should get a shot or two. Okay, nice. If he, Okay, I was just going to say, if he goes for Hog, we also have our Bowler, so there should only be like Two hits, I believe. Nice. Uh, unless you can place that better, we couldn't have avoided that second shot, but if our bowler was up a level, we would have avoided it, so I mean, it is what it is, I guess. I, sh I guess I should have upgraded the bowler, but oh well. <clears throat> Let's go for our E-Drag up high. So we're not doing too bad in the match right now. We're only down by like, a little bit, which, you know, isn't that big of a deal. And we'll go for our Firecracker like this. To pull the P.E.K.K.A. away from the tower. 
but not let the P.E.K.K.A. reach it. Alright, so he uses all that. Can I... Please? Ah, uh, It doesn't one-shot level 10s, but he had a level 9 Scar on me, so I don't know if it would one-shot or not. Firecracker is going to clutch here. Let's go for a bowler over here. I don't really need to worry about that wizard too much. Yeah, we can just ignore that wizard. Um, I don't think it'll do enough damage to matter. Okay, yeah, wizard doesn't do enough damage, and hog puts in a decent chunk of work. Let's get a, let's set up like a really big push over here, and then put like a heal spirit. I'm gonna go wall breaker ghost spam. He's probably gonna pack it. Okay, nice. He can arrow, but it won't be enough. Wait, destroy. Nice. I get both the wall breakers. Okay, I'm gonna go for a firecracker. The pressure of the lane too. I think we might take the tower on the right if we're lucky enough. Okay, does he Q do enough? No, that's only 123. Okay, I need. A little more damage. Cause that was a horrible hog. I don't know why I just did that. I'm going to go ghost just in case. Okay, we need him to play anything in front of that tower. I'm just going to go firecracker snipe. The peck will be distracted for long enough, so that doesn't matter. <sighs> okay, well, not not that, I guess. I guess I lied. I do not want the scar in front of there. Honestly, I'm just going to go for heal spirit to see if he'll fall for the bait. Okay, does wait, no the hog. The hog. Okay, this is getting way too close than I'd like it to. Firecracker, please get some anything. No! Please, no! Are you kidding me, man? I can't believe I just lost that. That guy's so lucky. If he had anything other than a Skarmy, we could have won. Oh, well, it is what it is. Also, let's claim these uh, daily tasks. I guess I'll open a banner box. I mean, I, I maxed out, so. Well, for some reason, there's only eight banners this season, so I'm assuming they're probably planning on, uh, like, releasing some challenges or something. Could get that. I mean, that's not too bad, I guess. All these are, oh, they're not even a rare. They're not yet collected. <laughs> I didn't know that, so thanks for telling me. And we got Tesla of Terror. I like that one. And uh, yeah, I will just keep going to some matches. So uh, I'll see you when we <laughs> win. <laughs> that is GG against BB per EO or something. Weird log bait deck. I don't know what that was, but uh, a dub is a dub. Oh, we get gold crates now? Nice. Okay. Big money news. Yeah, I lost against this guy. His deck unfortunately counters mine, and he's actually a somewhat decent player. So it is what it is. Yeah, that's GG again. I, like, what is with all these counters all of a sudden? I, I'm not even having an issue with card levels. Just, like, I just keep finding these stupid decks. Like, go away, Clash Royale. Oh, there we go, finally. Like, this guy is still a counter, by the way. I don't know what's happening. Like, <laughs> I, I guess we're moving Mega Knight? Like, I, I really... Yeah, me definitely Mega Knight log. Like, I really don't know. Hip, hip, hooray. Hip, hip. Hooray! We face another counter. Let's go! Woohoo! Oh wow! Look at that! Another counter. Who would have thought? Not me. It's amazing. I didn't find. A, I didn't find a counter. Wow! That is amazing. I countered him. Never thought that was possible. Thank God! I can't believe that this guy actually just lost that. Like that is just insane. Like wow. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. Like, that was so horrible. Yeah, I'm choosing Hunter Heal Spirits. <laughs> it's a pretty obvious choice. Oh my god, man. Wow. So all I have to say is just wow. Okay, let's upgrade our Heal Spirit. Then let's upgrade it again. There we go, level Heal Spirit. That's pretty good. Oh, like, okay. I've had people before say, like, Oh, the game changes what matchups you get, like, when you remove a card out of your deck to hard count you. It's obviously a lie, right? But, like, look at this. So, Mega Knight log, nothing, nothing, one log bait, nothing, barrel, princess, nothing, princess, princess, barrel, barrel, barrel. Right. And But then it, it kind of died down, it died down, it died down. And all of a sudden, Mega Knight Barrel Princess. Nothing. That Barrel Princess. Like, Barrel Princess. 
<laughs> Princess Garden Me? Like, like, what is happening? Like, <laughs> I, I'm just joking, but still, it's just weird how all of a sudden, like, all these things just come out of nowhere. But anyway, I guess I will keep going. I just want to say I have three firecrackers. <laughs> okay, never mind. We, went, we ended up winning, apparently. See, so, yeah, this poor guy didn't have arrows to kill my firecrackers. He had a magnite, but no arrows, so rest in peace to that guy. And we're going to get a ton of masteries here, so start working towards the rewards on these. Yeah, also, let's, jo let's join Onler, you know. Also, shout out Onler. Uh, he's a goat, so just want to say that. Got our rascals. See if we, all right, I'll cut and see if we find. Oh, never mind. I guess I'm not cutting the video. All right, so this is the two v two temporary onward exclusive. Let's send the night cheer. I actually have like balanced card levels now, so <laughs> I'm happy about that. All right, so let's go for our firecracker. Ah. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to snipe the Valkyrie, but I mean, it is what it is. Firecracker is going to get a lot of value here. Especially if she <laughs> doesn't get hit by the Mega Minion. Just keep going, Firecracker. Nice. Ice Woods tanker for Firecracker. Let's protect with some Rascals, I guess. Not too sure what Omler is using here. Um, it looks like a pretty random deck. This Firecracker is still alive. Oh, my God. Okay, okay, it's an E-Giant deck. That, okay, that makes, that makes sense now. There's that one Larry that will live, but it's gonna drag. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, the Onler almost got it. It's a shame. Um, guess we'll just go Heal Spear. Okay. <laughs> good thing we didn't, uh, <laughs> good thing he didn't place it in the Rage. Otherwise, that would be pretty bad, but oh well. We still uh, ended up making it fine. Yeah, not too happy with the Hog Hits. I agree there. It was kind of unfortunate. Okay, Valkyrie and Knight do come down. So, Almer's going to go for the Skelly Drags. I, I guess I'll go Firecracker to pull everything in. And then also get some nice damage on them. Works out pretty well for me. Let's go Wall Breakers in front so that they can't, like, activate King Tower. Or the Firecracker goes <laughs> out of her way to activate King Tower. Uh, thank you very much, Firecracker. That's exactly what we wanted. So, pretty cool the Firecracker did that for us. Almost in double Elixir, which is just, like, one times Elixir for 2v2. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why they just poisoned nothing, especially on the tower with more health, but you do you. Let's go for a heal spirit, and then let's go for E-Drag behind the E-Giant. Okay, we could get a pretty big push cooking up here. I think Omna should wait for the Wizard and P.E.K.K.A. to... Okay, he's not going to wait for it. Oh, he's the Evolve Lair, is it? <laughs> oh, here we go. Look at them go. Okay, nails everything in. I'm not sure if that's going to work or not. I guess we'll see. Do we have any Larrys? Oh, we don't. The rest of the okay, they just go for a random Prince of the Birds. Thank you very much. That's exactly uh, what I thought was going to happen, so that's why I went Wall Breakers. Let's go for our Bowler over here. The cannon will get hit, unfortunately, by the Prince's Long Lance, but, I mean, you know, it is what it is. So we've a decent amount of pressure on these guys now, but they have a Mega Knight. <laughs> Lightning comes down from Omler, decent lightning. We have two firecrackers now. Let's go ahead and... I'm just going to keep spamming to try and get back to firecrackers. I mean, if they can't deal with them, it's going to cause them a lot of pain. Firecracker is getting chip damage on the tower. Another firecracker comes out of nowhere to get more chip damage. The firecracker is our win condition right now. 370 health, we can do this. We can do this Omler, I believe. Rascal Boy of the Tank. Pretty terrible hog in my opinion. I don't know why they did that. Let's go for our wall breakers here. And let's just go for an EQ just to get some damage on the tower. And the wall breaker connects to take the game. Let's go. Good game indeed. Onler is the GOAT. We'll accept the friend request. Let's go, Onler. Alright, <laughs> I'll see you guys when we get to the next match. Here on temporary, we're back. We're just gonna buy everything in the shop because I am rich, so I can afford to do so. And so, we need to talk. So once again, I forgot about a card. Now this time, <clears throat> this time, it's a bit different. Now again, I claim full responsibility, it is my fault. But 
it's a bit of a different scenario. So, with the E-Giant, I unlocked it, and I just grabbed it, right? But if you remember, this funny little card right here, the Magic Archer, I unlocked him all the way back, and, like, I think it was around, like, Jungle Arena, like, Hog Mountain, I unlocked him, and I could only use him now, so it's been a while, you know? It slipped the mind, and I did accidentally play a match without the Marcher, but I can't remember what it was, hold on. Okay, I'm back, so anyways. <clears throat> it was a clan war battle, and now to be fair, um, I did purposely lose just so I could, <laughs> I could get a clan war attack in. So it wouldn't have mattered anyway, but at the end of the day, it's not about that. It's about me using the same card, so... You know, it is what it is. Um, we're here now. I've made sure that there's no new cards. As you can see, if I sort by arena... Thanks for going to the shop, that's what I wanted. And then go all the way to the top. Graveyard is the last card, and Graveyard is unlocked. It's Spooky Town, so we are now officially safe. <laughs> I've made sure that... You know, like, we're, we're all good now. We're good. We're going to upgrade a few cards. It's been a bit since I've uh, done anything, like, important on temporary. And we might be able to get level 27, depending how many card upgrades there are, but I'm not sure. I haven't really been keeping track. Um, <laughs> I just log in every day and get the stuff from the shop. Don't always have time to push temporary, unfortunately, as much as I'd like to. Um, yeah, I mean, not bad. I guess... I guess we'll pop two epic log cards on the E-John here. Uh, why not? Extra level, we get some XP. You know, I, I think it's a fair trade. But yeah, anyway, uh, let's also just get these useful. And uh, yeah, I think we'll just head to the next match. Here we are against uh, Giga... <laughs> You know, I'm just not gonna say that, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Also, the Nigerian scammer clan named this guy is... <laughs> I was gonna say certified goon. This guy is a certified goon. Oh my god, level 13 prince? Get out of here, you goon. This guy's gooning harder than any other goon has ever gooned in the history of goons. Like, oh my god. Also, something I find interesting is that apparently the word gooning is like a bad term. I didn't know that. Um, and I'm not like 100% sure what it means. But um, either way, I don't, I don't know what it's supposed to mean in that context. I, I just use the word goon because it sounds funny, so... Just putting that out there. Just putting that out there. <sighs> we get, so we we kind of need to save the sea drag. The sea drag is kind of a savior right now. Okay, he's gonna go for his dark prince. We're just gonna go marcher like this. Activate the king tower. Pull the dark prince. We'll take some damage from the firecracker. Unfortunately, he's gonna deal with this world ghost though. And if we can get our e drag down in a possibly e giant time, we might have a decent push here. But looks like he's not gonna do that. Excuse me. So, okay, there's his uh, prince. And he goes for a bomber, because I, I guess why not. We're just going to let the prince go. And then we're just going to go for E-Giant now. Hopefully we can make something happen. He's spent a decent bit of elixir, so I'm hoping something can happen. Just go for a heal spirit, see if anything uh, can chain. Kill the firecracker, please. Nice. Wait, hold on. That's some really good damage on the tower there. I was gonna go ahead and EQ this, hopefully kill the musky. Nice, okay, that's tower, that's tower, that's tower. So yeah, we don't have to worry about that anymore, which is really good, because uh, I don't know. Um 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 <laughs> please Please no Please no Okay wait the tower's still alive uh, what do I do here? I guess I go for ghost, try and take care of this firecracker. No Okay, wait, 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 go below like this, pull the prince, distract the firecracker. <laughs> I'm just gonna EQ these goblins. <laughs> Please. No, 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 no. Does he have a zap? Does he giant the pocket in case? Let's go! Let's go! 
<laughs> Get destroyed, you goon. Level 13 Prince. You should be ashamed. Should be ashamed for that level 13 Prince and whatever that name is. But, since I did accidentally, um, what do you call it, play matches without showing each individual card, because, you know, I like to do that every time I get a new card, I unlock it, I play a match and show it, so we're just going to do two in a row. Alright, up against Goyo here, from the four horsemen, let's hope that this guy uh, doesn't have two horsemen that are level 13. Oh, he is one of them. <laughs> it's level 10, though, so I'm fine with that. Let's go for E-Drag high like this. Just zap the Dark Prince immediately. I was going to go for a march like this. Pretty aggressive, but it could work out pretty well. Let's see what happens. So yeah, we are going to get a decent chunk of damage from that, so we will gladly take that. Um, I like saying the word that. <laughs> then let's go for our bowler off to the side like this. And it works out pretty well. Also, I, like, I just don't understand, like, where does the bowler's ball go? Like, he throws it, and then it's just going, and it just crumbles all of a sudden. Like, what? <laughs> okay, okay, calm down, we can talk, we can talk, we can talk. What is happening? What is happening? Okay, thankfully he played a really bad barrel. What is happening? Level 13 baby D. Level 14 mini pack <laughs> <laughs> what did I do to deserve this? I just want to play a temporary. <laughs> Is this my punishment for accidentally not playing? Oh, you can't be kidding me, man. Uh, hopefully the marcher plays at the very least. Okay. Man, screw my phone or Clash Royale, man. Like, my internet is completely fine. It only happens on, only happens on Clash Royale. I don't know why. <sighs> okay, um... I guess Idra likes a safer play here. I mean, we gotta mainly worry about that mini P.E.K.K.A. Um, we have Rascals, if need be. Well, it's not the match he's level 12 Witch, but that I'm not, like, too shocked about. Speaking of shock, let's go for Ejon here, just to hopefully kill everything. Okay, he's gonna go for uh, another bad barrel, which is fine with me. We actually perfectly take care of it, which I thought wasn't gonna happen, because I thought I played the Ghost a little too late, but we're fine. Okay, he goes for his Valk. Let's just go for our Marcher here. He's gonna go for Mini Pekka. We're just gonna go for Rascals and Heal Spirit to heal up the Rascal Boy. Maybe? No, okay. Uh, this could be kind of bad here. I quit. No, we're fine. Go for E Drag. Okay, this guy is just a fan of playing these awful barrels. I am a fan of you, sir, for playing these awful barrels. Actually, no, I'm not a fan of you. I'm a fan of these awful barrels. <laughs> I am not a fan of the uh, level 13 Baby D and <clears throat> level 14 Anya. Oh, okay, he's a mech knight, because why wouldn't he? Let's go for our Marcher low, and then let's go for our Rascals off to the side like this. Make sure to heal this Rascal Boy, just so uh, we can defend for a little longer. Okay, very nice. He's going to go for a Baby D. Okay, he's just going for everything over there. <laughs> he is not holding back. He's going hog wild. He didn't hold back on his card levels either, as we can clearly see. Let's go e giant up high to pull everything over here. Uh, no, it's kind of bad. If it goes barrel, it could be screwed here. Okay, he just plays terrible. I sorry, a terrible magnet for some reason. Let's go ahead and heal up the e dragon rascal boy. Hopefully, yeah, no, it doesn't. Um, please. Okay, wait, 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 there might be hope, there might be hope. And now we lose. Wait, 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 wait. Do not let that thing cross. Yes, he goes for another terrible barrel for some reason. We're saved, temporarily. That was not a joke. It just kind of came out like that. Waste your mini packa, please. Just waste your mini packa. Just waste your mini packa. Whatever. Just go in. Please. Please, I need damage. S stop the Dark Prince. No, no, the mini packa. No. No, <laughs> dude. What is this overleveled stuff, man? Come on. And there goes the internet again.
Yep, I, oh, oh, that time it actually did go out, but still a full bar, so I don't know how that works, but anyway. That was unfortunate, to say the least. <laughs> Frick that guy. But, let's go ahead, claim 20 E-Tracks, very big cash money, unlike what just happened. And we get 100 Heal Spirits, which is, again, pretty cash money. Some might even see... Some might even say money cash. Upgrader E-Drag, Upgrader Heal Spirit. Huge upgrades there. Maybe if the E-Drag was level 10 that match, <laughs> I wouldn't have just perished in the mini packet, but it is what it is. Let's also see if we... Okay, no. Uh, let's see if we can get to level 28 here. Didn't just say there was an upgrade? Okay, yeah, there we go. Being a little bit blind there. But that is going to be level 28. I don't know if that does anything for us, but pretty cool. We get a level up chest. Please have some good stuff in there. Obviously the gold gems will take. Log cards, obviously take. Bats, that's okay. Arrows, okay. Fire spirit, eh. Barbs, okay. Valk, eh. Dark princes will take. And now we got a legendary. Come on, come on. Something good, baby. Graveyard? Alright, so. We can upgrade graveyard. <laughs> um, that's uh, something, I guess. Yeah, I can't use Graveyard, though, unfortunately. Because this is Rascal's Hideout, and this is Spooky Town. Wait. Wait. Oh, wait. Did I just do it again? I just did it again. I, th I think whenever I got a card from the previous arena, if there were still cards from... That arena in the deck, I could still replace it, right? Is that how it worked? I think that's how it worked. <sighs> Man. <laughs> okay, so. Can you... Like, I'm, I'm at full bars. I'm at full bars this time. Okay, wait, so. Can't replace Rascal's Heal Spirit, E-Giant, Bowler, or Marcher. Um, okay. So we gotta pick the Ghost, E-Drag, or EQ. Or did I replace Graveyard? I really don't remember. Hold on, I'm gonna check footage to see if I replaced Graveyard or not. Okay, so I just checked the footage, and I literally just bought it and then never used it. Like, why am I doing, man? Oh, my God. Ah, uh, it's gonna be a tough one. As weird as this is, is <sighs> I think EQ is the choice. I think EQ is the... wait, is EQ in this arena? Okay, good, okay. Yeah, I think EQ is the choice, unfortunately. I think Ghost and E Track are just too vital, so I guess we're going to another match. Alright, I've been so big death here, man. Man, what is going on with me recently, man? Like I, for I forgot the marcher, which I understand the marcher. Uh, for that, I think I get a pass, right? Also, there's... I don't know what that weird golden thing's all about, but it's been doing that ever since he upped it. Anyway. The, the marcher thing, I understand. I'll give myself free pass. The E-Giant, it's like, what are you doing, man? Come on. But the graveyard? I literally bought the graveyard and then just didn't put it in my deck. Now, the reason I didn't do that is because I usually like to wait until I can commentate to do that. But still, like, that is just unreal. Also, this mini pack, I just can't get a hit on anything. There we go. Come on, a little thank you. I'm just going to go bowler here. I, I just want to tank for the ghost in the tower. And we can just march it like this. It should line up to the tower there. Very nice. Three free hits. Well, I guess it wasn't free, but you know what I mean. Ooh, Marcher's on. Nice. Ooh, and it pierces one of the minions. The Ghost is gonna avoid the minions, too, so we're gonna get a decent chunk of damage there. I could have went Heal Spirit, maybe, and then... You know what? <laughs> Let's test out our new Graver, baby. <laughs> he does not care. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well, we are probably doing a Tower Trade. But I'm happy to partake in this Tower Trade. Already up a lot of damage. We're just going to go E-Drag like this for this mini P.E.K.K.A. I don't want to get 3 crowned. Uh, that would not be ideal or cool or any of the above. Let's just go ahead and zap this mini P.E.K.K.A. Get all the pancakes out of the system. Don't know what that means, but just go along with it. Goes for this princess here. Take care of the princess. He's going to go for a pretty terrible minions in my opinion. 
Oh, really? That, that did not just happen. Okay, let's go Mitra here to take care of the minions, Golem, and Baby D. Can I not get three crown? Can I not get three crown? Can I not get three crown? Can I? Hey, thanks, Marcher. Thanks. Wow. Thanks, Marcher, for being a complete idiot. Wow, that is so cool. Very much appreciated. Thank you, buddy. Yo, what's going on, everyone? It's been a while since we've done, you know, just a temporary talking video, you know? It's been a bit. So, I mean, yeah, let's just get into it. I'm just going to upgrade this bowler. And this. Or, sorry. These rascals. And, uh, yeah. Alright, up against E man underscore do eight here. <sighs> so yeah, I mean, start off, I guess we'll talk with the little prince, and he is exactly uh <laughs> what I expected. Pretty broken champion. Uh he's definitely the most broken champion and maybe card in the game right now. I mean Don't get me wrong, the Evo Knights, Evo Barbs, and Recruits are still problems, but the little prince is kinda just outshining them right now, like in terms of popularity. No one's no one really cares about those cards at the moment. They're just focused on the little prince and how to make him work in their decks just because he's only three elixirs, so better cycle, three card cycle. And you know, overall he's just a pretty good range card, along with the fact that uh what do you call it? He has his guardian, and let's just go for a rascal's grave right here. I think it went pretty aggressive, so we'll see if we can make anything happen. Um Rack Rascal Girls on the tower. Look at them go. Nice. Okay, good damage, good damage. Yeah, oh, they killed the firecracker. Let's go, Larry's. And yeah, that's an easy tower there, right there. Let's take that e Mondo away. I just smell popcorn or something. I didn't actually smell popcorn, but it smelled like popcorn or butter or something. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, so he's kind of taking over the meta right now. And by kind of taking over the meta, I mean like he is the meta. <laughs> like, yeah, he, he's definitely a fun card. Even though he is broken, I'm just glad that there is some finally just some variety happening in this game. Um,. And it's kind of funny and ironic that I say that because one of the most popular decks right now is like a <laughs> little prince, like a minor cycle, a control deck. Or sorry, not minor cycle, um, like minor poison control deck. So it's kind of <clears throat> kind of funny seeing that, but it is what it is. We already knew that the little prince would be utilized in cycle decks. I mean, come on, he's three elixir champion. Like we've never had a three elixir champion before. The cheapest we've had is four, and the most expensive is five. So. You bring a 3 elixir champion into the game, and uh, that is definitely going to break the uh, meta in-game, especially with how powerful he is. And let's pull this uh, Skabelton King up high here. He's going to pop the ability, which is fine. Bowler's balls are big enough to reach over there, and the ghost will smack away. Uh, let's just go for a marcher like this. That's not what was supposed to happen, but I mean, at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter. Let's go for an E-Giant Mill. Unfortunately, it's not fat enough because the marcher does get sniped. And even if the marcher didn't get sniped, he still had the Mega Knight who likes crushing things, so... That was kind of overall. So these Larrys slowly killing themselves, but they are taking care of my E Giant. He did miss a Rascal Girl with to take care of these Larrys quickly, though, because I do not want those things just overwhelming me. Trust me, you do not want a lot of white on you. You do not. All right, so let's go for our Bowler, and then Bowler should kill his Firecracker, maybe? Yep, thankfully she takes 13 years remembering her times of Vietnam, so we are good there. E Giant is going to tank once again. Ghost is on the tower, smacking away. That is going to be a decent chunk of damage right there. Uh, the firecracker somehow pulls the ghost back, I'm not sure. Um, let's go for our marcher here, our rascals. He's not breaking through. That is an easy dub here, baby. Alright, here, up against the real Apu. I thought it was the fake one. Thank God he clarified. What do we do without that from Deutschland? Alright, so anyway. Another thing I want to talk about, which is kind of like the complete opposite end of the spectrum here. Is the Evo Archers now? We saw the Evo Archers, right? We saw them things like shred a tower, completely take a tower by themselves with just them and an ice spirit. Just an ice spirit lets them take a full princess tower. Like that was pretty, you know, bananas. You know, we were all like, ah, no, please don't put that into the game. I'm scared and stuff. But then now it's just like nothing. It's radio silence. The archers like are completely off the grid. No one hears from them. They're like, what's going? Oh, okay. um, but yeah, like, they're just, yeah, they're, they're not underwhelming, they're still really good, but the Little Prince is such a good card that everyone forgot about the Evolution Archers, and they're just there, I mean, like, they're good, they are really good and annoying, you can't kill them with arrows, which, I mean, cool feature, by the way, thanks, um, we all love the last time an Evolution couldn't kill without arrows, <laughs> right, guys, uh, anyway, but yeah, so they're really good right now, and they're still being used in decks with, like, Little Prince and stuff. Trust me, like, they're being, like, their potential is being realized. But, like, compared to Little Prince, like, no one cares. Like, 
just it's just crazy. Like they're expected to be such a good card, and again, they are. I know I can repeat myself, but I just want to emphasize like how much just no one cares right now. Also, let's protect this marcher a little bit with my bullet. Beautiful damage there. Um, yeah, kind of crazy. Um, but I've I've dealt with them a few times now. They are really annoying, especially when they have little prince too, because I mainly play fireballs my big spell, and you gotta choose whether or not you want to fireball the archers or little prince. And both are really annoying. The archers will shred you, and the little prince just sends out his guardian, just ruins your life. So, kind of a tough choice there. Also, not a tough choice is uh, going to be going E drag, and then going for our. Kind of hoping that wouldn't just happen, but it is what it is. Let's go for a um, archer lineup here, get some free damage on the tower. Works out pretty well for me. There you go. Really nice miner once again. Um, <laughs> I, I think the fake Apu would have got the good miner there. <laughs> okay, go smacks away. Let's just line up this boulder so we hit the marcher, hopefully. I think it should hit the marcher. I don't think he's far away. Okay. Well, far away, not I meant he is far away. Let's go for Rascals. I have a feeling he might just poison this, so let's go. Yep, let's go Graveyard now. Perfect timing. He's what really on the looks right now. You can only fear Spear Goblins and maybe a log in a second here. Marcher is going to snipe away the bomb tower. Great, they're taking the tower, though. It's too easy. Oh, I thought I was going to go for the miner on the marcher again. Yeah, nothing really working out for this guy this match. I mean, the real Apu got shit on. All right, up against Heart. <laughs> I'm not going to try to pronounce that. Um, also, sorry for that last joke. That was, like, pretty awful as a stinker, you could say. Um, yeah, I'm sorry, I'll stop. Like, I'll stop. I'm sorry. Flush down all those jokes. We're done now. We're done. Anyway, the next thing I want to talk about is CRO, right? CRO is an event, you know, like the qualifiers. It's an event that a lot of people look forward to. If you're a casual player, maybe not. But if you're someone like me who's, like, kind of competitive at the game, then, you know, you look forward to it. It's a fun challenge. It's the hardest challenge in the entire game. Look forward to it. You know, you're going to face some of the best players in the game just because, you know, you kind of have to. Also, really nice ability there. Good for us. Um... But yeah, so Clash Royale announced that CRL, you know, such a beloved event, would be taking place on November 10th, I believe was the date, and running until November 20th. And you know, that's a good amount of time. Ten days, that's a solid amount of time. That's a week and a half. That is enough time for someone to easily play multiple challenges, or sorry, like multiple entries in the challenge, right? Or just complete it. So then what Clash Royale decided to do was make an even bigger brand move, and move it from the 15th to the 20th. Now, sorry, it might not be the 15th to the 20th, but I just know it's five days now. So I could be wrong about that, don't quote me on that. But it's five days now. You have five days, right, to play the challenge. That is half of the time in the game's hardest challenge. That's not very cash money, you know, <laughs> that is really not cash money. That is not the green. Like, that is in the red zone. Like, we do not want that. Why they did that, I don't know. I, like, I really think they just enjoyed, like, making the player base as angry as possible. I mean, I could be wrong about that, but I think I'm right. But it's... It's uh, something. Also, let's stun this little prince out and he's just annihilating me. Thank you very much. He's gonna get stunned by the E-Giant anyway, but... Just wanted to make the process a bit faster. And let's go for a graveyard over here, maybe. e dread cross. Nice. Big cash money. Kill the firecracker. Walk back onto the Larry's. Oh, beautiful defense. Or not defense. A play right there. Offense. Whatever you want to call it. Go should smack these barbs. Yeah, he's pretty good. And then, yeah. Defense is pretty much settled. Don't take a lot of damage there. Okay, unfortunately, heal spirit did come down a bit late. That wasn't intended to happen. But it is what it is. I'm just going to go for a graveyard on his king tower. And then just go for a bowler of the pocket. Okay, well, we're sniping the little prince now. Is he going to pop the ability? He's giving me so much bowler value right now. Alright, so we don't get a lot of damage there. Uh, I'm going to try and take his... Uh, never mind. Oh, we still took it. <laughs> you try to prevent it, but nope, not happening today. So, I mean, yeah. Yeah, I can't believe they actually just pushed CRL to five days. Like, what is that? Five days? Come on now. Come on. Five days. Really? Five? Five days? You know, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. I mean, it is what it is, I guess. Oh, hello, Clan Wars. Anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, yeah.
I will see you in the next one. Take care. It, can you cut, please? Man, it has been a while since I have actually done anything on temporary other than just log in, see what's in the shop, and that's it. I wonder, did I check already? No, I didn't. All right, well, we'll just buy here, I guess. Just buy all this, make sure I don't buy the gem thing this time. It's not there, but, you know, just, just make sure. Also, we unlocked the Ice Wiz, so that's cool. Um, what well, Arena's Ice Wiz? Spooky Town? I, okay, so I have to replace something then. How many cards are I from Spooky Town? One. Two or three, I think? So what, there's... Ghost, Graveyard, Ice Wiz. Ghost, Graveyard... Is everything I don't think E drags from the same arena, right? Like that I'm in right now, yeah, it's not okay. Um So E drag, Ghost, and Marcher. So I got Ice Wiz. I I guess for March makes the most sense. Well, let's hop into a match. Actually, wait, never mind, all I'm gonna I'm gonna get this first. And uh, these two masters right here. Very nice. And Rascals. Level 2. Oh yeah, baby. Alright, now let's get into the match. Alright, up against Augusto 300 here, so... Man, it has been, <laughs> it's been a while since I've played uh, actual ladder with, uh, with Temporary. I'll, I'll tell you that. So Ice was here. I think if it was a level higher... Yeah, if it was a level higher, we'd prevented uh, that hit there, but... Okay, this guy is just spending all of his elixirs, so what, he just spent like 8 there with the princess, so that's like 11, so we're up a decent amount right now. And he just keeps feeding my bowler, which I mean, go ahead, I, I do not mind. Yeah, I'm not sure what this guy is doing. Unfortunately, my bowler doesn't get healed, which is probably the biggest scam in the, uh, history, but anyway. Let's go for our rascals here, can this... Yep, he defends because he has a 3 elixir card. <laughs> so dumb. Uh, yeah, you played so well, man. Wait, is he not going to pop the ability? Okay, I mean, it's fine by me. I don't know why he waited so long to decide to defend. But again, that is fine with me. We'll just go for our ghost here. A bit delayed. Uh, I didn't know if the E-Drag was going to follow or not, so that's why I waited a second, just so I could get a bit more value. Uh, let's go ahead and ice with... Seriously. Just stop, man. I am kind of scared to use my bowler because I feel like he's going to go for a golden barrel and I want my uh, bowler for it. But yeah, he's going to go for it. Honestly, I shouldn't even just use my bowler there. I should have just went like Rascals or something. Yeah, nice bowler bowl. <laughs> Get that bowler as a paid actor. I don't know what that's all about. But yeah, I probably I still should have waited though. That's my bad. Do you know when to stop, man? <laughs> like, Just stop spamming. It hasn't worked for you, so I don't know why you keep going. Excuse me, um, I'm just going to E-Giant into this, honestly. Perfect, that's exactly what I wanted. I didn't say that I was predicting that out loud, because I didn't know if he'd do it or not, but... Well, I guess that's an entire point of prediction, but anyway. I'm just going to pre-Rascals for his barrel here. Doesn't end up going for it, surprisingly. Um, just go for Ice was in the back, he's going to go for a Little Prince. Definitely going to allow my bowler here or go for an E-Drag for that, because uh, that is really annoying, and I do not want to deal with that uh, for too much longer. So let's just go ahead and get the perfect bowler strike, baby. Let's go. Take care of all this nonsense. Uh, once again, I don't know why he keeps lining everything up with my E-Giant here, or bowler, I mean. Uh, let's go for our E-Giant Grave right here. Obviously one of the most skillful pushes in the entire game. And let's go for this Ice Wiz to snipe this princess. Get rid of her quick. I forgot he actually had e Wiz. He hasn't played it in a while, but... And that is GG. I don't really know what this guy uh, was trying to do, aside from spam me, but he didn't try to do that. He very well did that. So yeah, that's going to be game with this uh, brand new amazing deck, and that is a lie. It's not, it's not amazing. But uh, yeah, let's keep pushing with this deck. Let's go ahead and pop open this daily task. Let's open these banner boxes too, because they're full, so I may have as well. I'll uh, we get the cocktail wizard. It's all right. I, it's, I don't know. The banners these seasons, or not these seasons, this season is just, eh. Yeah, I don't like that one either. So, I mean, not really good, but, oh, nice. <laughs> That's cool, I guess. 
on to the next match. And that is GG against 20% uh, underscore I pound sign thing, Euro. I, I don't know anymore. I, I, I just, uh, what do you call it? <laughs> Resumed out of uh, instinct, but yeah, I'm not showing this. Because right, like, if I didn't explain why I just did that, it'd be awkward. And, like, I could cut it out, but like, I don't, re don't really want to cut it out because I'm kind of lazy. And plus, I just think it's fine to leave this in, so yeah. I did not see that Mega Knight. And that is GG. And that is GG against Lucas. <laughs> it has been a while since I've claimed a <laughs> Trevor Rogue reward. Let's see. Gold, Fire Spirits, Hogs, Hunter. So what, we probably... Like, Rascal's like out of a thousand. Like, I could use some Heal Spirits, maybe? Uh, uh, heal Spirits, please. Please. That is unfortunate. But I guess we can go on a bit of an upgrade spree here. I haven't upgraded in a while either, so... Let's just go ahead and upgrade whatever we can. I mean, we need all the XP possible, and uh, gold is not an issue at the moment. I, I don't know if I will ever run out of... When did I unlock Bandit? <laughs> uh, not again. For... <laughs> you know, I... <laughs> Alright, well, there goes one of the cards from uh, the previous arena. Man, I am slacking on temporary men, like, not on, like, getting the daily shot, but just, I have not played in so long. Also, Little Prince isn't available too much later, so that's why I'm not using him. I actually have a legitimate reason this time. <laughs> I didn't just forget. I can't believe I did that again, man. Also, in front of Dragon's too far back, too, so. There he is. Like, I can't believe I forgot about Bandit, man. That was the only thing I didn't need to forget, and then I forgot. I remembered everything else. <sighs> That's the issue with, like, uh, like recording everything you do. It's just, I didn't want to put the Bandit in my deck slot, so, like, I could, like, show on video that I put in the deck slot. It doesn't really matter either way, but still. Yeah, that, 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 that sucks, but it is what it is. Like, I can't change the past, unfortunately. Otherwise, I would change a lot of things. <laughs> also, we've already leveled up, but I would just keep upgrading. So, there we go. That's our entire upgrade spree done. And we are now level 29, so that's pretty cool. Let's see what our level up chest gives us. Gold, usual, gems. I can use some of those. E-Spirit, Rascals, Cannon. This is terrible, man. Mm -hmm, okay. Let's see what the Legendary gives us. Use like what a bandit. You was when you unlock you was. Um. Nope, not. All right, we can't use you was unfortunately. So <laughs> this time I can't use that card. All right, we can also upgrade Zappies. I cannot use this. All right, just reminder to myself. I'm not saying that to anybody but myself. All right then. Well, let's keep going. All right, up against Wasson here. Oh, <laughs> it is. It, it's been a while. Um, it has been a while since I've done a match in temporary. Um, like, I think it's been over a week. <laughs> uh, but it is what it is, you know. And my beautiful bowler placement for the hog there. Okay, he's gonna go Princess. I'm just gonna set up an E-Giant in the back because he has to do something else for that bowler, so I'm not too concerned about spending that elixir there. He does also go for a Valkyrie, so he's committing a lot of elixir here, so I think I'm gonna go for the Rascals. And we should be good. He's still steal this E-Giant too, so I mean the creature is just strolling down the lane. What is he gonna do? Who knows? Not me. Okay, there's the princess. Ah, <laughs> but I kinda wish I didn't use Bandit right there. <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh god, it's not fine. <laughs> Please, no, the little prince. Heal spirit like this. Bowler now, and maybe I might almost sort of potentially live. Let's just ice blaze everything. Slow everything down. Use the bowler's balls to slow down the magnetic nice balls. Okay. Okay. I think we're good. <laughs> we're good. Okay, can you, like, not let him... 
Ah, oh, this goon. He is goon, but we should be fine. Okay, you got some Inferno Dragon. Oh, we take out the Inferno Dragon, take the Inferno Dragon. Yes, let's go. Go for our bandit level. Also, that's pretty good, so if I can like, <clears throat> force out a lot of stuff, I can just go for each on. He's gonna have to go for each drag, or I drag him in. And then I can go for my each. No, I bump. <laughs> Stupid little prince man. Slow everything down again. Oh, protect the bowler. Okay, I think I'll go for Ejon here because the blur's still alive, so I can't go hogs. So that's pretty good. And then let's Okay, he's gonna try and go for a hog, I think. Let's go for Ejrag here. Damn. Let's protect E Giant Rascals. Uh, I'm just gonna go for a graveyard, I guess. <laughs> Slow everything down. Go to the ice woods, go to the ice woods, yes, yes, yes. Go we giant, go Larry's. Big fat ginger, lo tiny little white men. Combine forces into one. Let's go, baby, it's too easy. Let's go. Easy, baby. And some free gold, so that's cool. Easy W again, baby. No W. W. Button replay. W from the replay again. But this time we get two E giants. So that's pretty cool. And it's also the stuff, I guess. Let's get all of this. It's so amazing. What, such good rewards. Also, change my banner. What you think? Sheesh. W, baby. Take the tower. No. Some more free gold. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. W baby, never mind. W part two baby, baby. W. Holy crap! That's a lot of cards. That's insane. Win. Three bowlers. Strike. Okay, in the next match, this could be it. This could be a heat. I'm at. 4569 he's at 4601 so this could give me 31 if I win right now so you know stakes are high money's on the line I'm not a betting man but excuse me if I was I'd probably be broke anyway so <laughs> you know I was gonna say minor level prince it's probably like a minor poison deck but he just whipped out his hog like, you know no, I'm not saying I don't want to see someone whip out their hog on me but it is, a, it is a Monday, after all, so, I mean, it doesn't count. Ooh, look at the great fire damage. No, he's locked. I think I just bore like this off to the side. Yeah, I can't really take care of that Mega Knight very well, but... Okay, so he's just going to take that tower no matter what, so I'm just not going to try and defend it more than I already am. Might be like a Weech on here, though. Just maybe? He did waste the decent chunk of elixir, but it's not like he's really, really low or anything, just I, I know I have a slight advantage right now. I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna go for a bandit pressure. Okay, perfect. Hopefully it doesn't have any elixir to do with the bandit. Nice, come on, we just need to take this tower, take the tower, take the tower, take the tower, bandit, thank you. Let's go, bandit. And bandit takes out some of the spears, very good. Okay. So you might think this is bad, just because a uh, two tower situation in graveyard, but I can always go Rascals or Bowler or Ejon in the pocket, so we should be fine. I'm just going to go for my defensive Ice Wiz here. I'm just going to wait till double, and then I think I'm going to go in with my Rascals, see what he does. Okay, he's not doing anything. Oh, that's kind of unfortunate, but it could work. Please take a little Prince, take a little Prince, take a little Prince, take a little Prince. <laughs> okay, we're getting... Oh, the Rascal Girls, the Rascal Girls, go, go. Yes, Rascal Girls, yes. Let's go. Rascal girls are the goat of the century, might I add. Slow down the hog. And we'll just go e drag here for this Mega Knight so I don't get three crowned by the Mega Knight and the Mercher. We should be fine. I'm just gonna go Rascals and pile like this. Let's go Bowler here. 
take care of the little prince and the marcher. I are taking a lot of three crown damage, but we should be fine. Okay, that was a terrible ability. I'm gonna go in. Oh, hold, wait, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. Please! Oh, oh. Okay, this is, this is getting way too close. Oh, perfect, perfect! He has to magnite, he has to magnite. I, I suppose just in case he goes hog. That should be game. Let's go. Please be enough, please be enough, please be enough, please be enough, please be. Yes, let's go. Oh, let's go, baby. I haven't seen this in a while. A new arena, Serenity Peak. We're safe. Ooh, freeze. We're safe. Oh, let's go. Let's go, dude. We're safe. Finally get a temporary video out. So anyways, level 29. Uh, 2046 out of 6,000. 1,344,037 gold. 409 gems. This is our deck. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.